Hello everyone, I am Dr. Mahesh Thunakarasu. I welcome you all back to this uh, new session, a uh, new video on um, COVID 19's vaccine status. Where do we stand at this uh, point in time in terms of COVID 19's vaccine? Okay, so in order to get this complete or full information, please make sure you watch this full video without skipping it. All right, if you have not subscribed to my channel, please go ahead and hit the subscription button and do like it or leave a comment down below if you like this video. All right, let's get in there, man. In COVID 19's vaccine, uh, you know, many developed countries or even developing countries are in this race of making COVID-19 vaccine. You know, uh, including USA, Russia, UK, England, China, uh, uh, even Brazil uh, in African countries, they are also in this race of making COVID-19 vaccine, right? So what we have been doing in terms of COVID-19 vaccine, uh, in India, this Bharat Biotech International Laboratory, in collaboration with ICMR, they have already entered uh, uh, human phase trials. They have already given those vaccines uh, to uh, people or volunteers uh, to see the uh, response to the vaccination. Okay, and uh, this has been going on in different hospitals in India, like Hyderabad and Delhi, uh, to name those hospitals like Nizam's Institute of Medical Sciences in Hyderabad, and uh, following which um, aims in Delhi, uh, they have also uh, you know um, recruited uh, healthy volunteers uh, to give vaccines to them to and uh, and uh, follow up with them to see that uh, immune response how they do. To the vaccine so yeah and then the trial center for covaxin in bhuvaneshwar is also to begin the human trials what happened earlier the icm or landed in controversy because they set a guideline for vaccine developers uh, that the vaccine uh, will be or uh, must be out on august 15th not only india even many countries like uh, there is a laboratory what we call it is Oxford and AstraZeneca, they are hand in hand together uh, from this is Oxford, a UK based uh, laboratory. They were the ones, uh, uh, you know, started making this uh, COVID vaccine and then they already started uh, phase trials, human trials. Now they are already in this um, phase three. The clinical data, uh, what they get from those study, they are uh, regularly publishing it on Lancet. And they claim that uh, people who have received uh, those uh, vaccine from uh, Oxford and uh, AstraZeneca uh, collaboration, the people who have uh, started showing, uh, you know, production of antibodies, uh, both, uh, you know, cell-mediated immune response and the production of antibodies as well. And then very soon, I mean, we can't expect that vaccine in a, in a month or so, uh, probably that uh, vaccine that is being under test by uh, Oxford and AstraZeneca will be out by the end of this 2020. But uh, this Covaxin is being developed in India and we, hopefully that vaccine should be out in a month or so like you know as government or, or every scientist claim that that vaccine will be out uh, uh, in, in late August or maybe before the end of this year. You know, hopefully if that vaccine comes out um, in, uh, you know, into our market, a lot of people will get benefited, right? The thing is the Serum Institute of India, that's the largest uh, vaccine developer in the world. So. This SII, uh, the CEO of Serum Minister of India, uh, they have already gotten approval from uh, uh, you know, DCGI of India uh, to run uh, human trials of uh, even this Oxford developing uh, uh, vaccine by the AstraZeneca. If you take Brazil, in Brazil they are already you know, uh, testing uh, different uh, vaccines developed by uh, China and um, Oxford AstraZeneca based uh, vaccine. In addition to these two vaccines, they have already included a US based pharmaceutical company. Uh, this is what a Pfizer. So Brazil is running uh, uh, clinical trials on three uh, vaccines developed by three different uh, countries. So, uh, you know, our Indian government has given approval for two vaccines. Uh, one is uh, developed by this uh, um, by Bharat Biotech and the other one is by the so it is a pharmaceutical company. So hopefully if everything goes well, uh, we should be getting this uh, COVID-19 vaccine um, by the end of this year, uh, whether, whether it may be like Oxford or AstraZeneca developed a COVID vaccine or our um, indigenous vaccine, Covaxin is being uh, under uh, human trials uh, that's being developed by this um, Bharat Biotech International Limited. Hopefully everything goes well. We should be getting our vaccine um, maybe in August or by the end of this 2020 to get this virus eradicated. And uh, hopefully we all should uh, get back to our normal life and routine daily activities. All right, guys, uh, I think I have given you some bit of information to you about this uh, COVID-19 vaccine. I'll see you back in our next video with more information on a different topic. Until then, it's bye-bye, Dr. Mahesh signing out, okay?